Oh, hey, 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 whoa! Oh, whoa! What the hell? Hey guys, Mr. Miola here and welcome back to a new Ark Survival Evolved video. Got an awesome one planned for today, but before we get started, I just want to touch on a few things. Number one, thank you so much for all the support and feedback over the new setup. I realized I messed up some of the audio syncing um, partway through last episode and I apologize for that, but thanks for pointing it out to me. Number two, you guys also said you like this weird stuff behind me. This has always been here, it's just been out of camera view. And someone even picked up on that tiny little hearthstone, I don't even know if this thing pops up, this little hearthstone like squishy, that came in like a loot box like months ago. And this sign, I've had this for years. Enough about that. Number three, check this out. So last episode we went and we tamed our little moss chops here. Apparently though, if there's any sort of like terror or activity around the place, he bolts it, he runs, he legs it. So you guys advised me I should probably keep this guy indoors. So we're gonna go and bring him over. All right guys, enough with the hissing. And uh, if he wants to follow, which he does, he's kind of galloping his way over. Um, we'll go and bring him indoors. We'll go and bring him inside. He's a nice little cutie guy. I, I still don't understand how they work in terms of um, harvesting. You can harvest like weird ingredients and stuff from things. I, I'm assuming you feed him meat and then, and, then, and then he harvests something weird from the meat. I'm not entirely sure. But um, I kind of want to look into that a little bit further. Maybe not today. We might put that off a little bit. And the fourth thing we're going to do is name the little sucker. He needs a name. And I've chosen one from the comments. So he's, he's a moss chops. That's what type of dinosaur he is. In fact, let's bring him in a little bit further into the base. And it's a little bit dark. Why are all of my lights off, actually? Hold on a second. You sit right there, little Mr. Moss chops for now. He who has the name of moss chops right now. All right. Let's turn the lights on. We need some more lights. Can I... I just want to... There we go. I want to um, change the settings so that it doesn't... It's not automatic. So whenever it's daytime, they turn themselves off. We don't want that. I like I like to have them... All right, there we go. Turn it on. I want to have them just on all the time because... I don't know. They don't turn themselves back on, basically, is what I'm saying. Anyways, we're going to name this guy. I've chosen the name. I really like the name. Thank you to everyone who left comments on the last video. We had a lot of them to go through. But we are going to be naming this guy... Pork chops. <laughs> Wait, I spelled it wrong. Pork chops. There we go. All right. Pork chops is our new little friend here. Our new little, I don't even know what you want to call him. This little dragon looking dude. Our moss chops is now known as pork chops. And he's a little animal. All right. So today I want to continue getting rid of this base. We got very little bit left things left to do. One of those things is getting rid of this industrial grill. We're not really getting rid of it. We just got to like move it. And I've gone and taken everything. I went and moved the remaining um, inventories. The thing in my bobbies, the, the boxes and stuff. We got rid of them. So there's only one thing left to do, and that is demolishing the industrial grill, which hurts because it's such a waste of ingredients. But but there it is, okay? There it is. We got 100 metal from it, a bunch of crystal and oil and a bunch of other stuff. I still got to remove these things too. Damn it. Ah, that's, that's expensive. That's expensive things to do. Anyways, let's go throw this stuff in, and we'll see what we need. 100 metal, crystal, um, and cementing paste. So crafting, we got... The industrial grill. We need another 62 metal and 15 crystal. Hopefully we got that in here. I went and topped up a bit of metal recently. I guess that's it there. All right, so let's go and grab half of that. Actually, we need crystal as well. Like what, 15 crystal was it? Something something silly like that. Such a little amount. We might need to actually go for a fly to grab this. No, we got it. We got it. We got it. Woo -hoo -hoo. Okay. Okay. Throw that in there. Throw that in there. Craft it up. Let's get it. Let's get it. Hell yeah. It's on the way already. That took no time at all. All right. Okay. I'll throw you in there. And uh, now we got to find a place to drop this thing. Where are we going to put it? Where am I going to put this? Like, I, I didn't really I didn't really think this through. Um, I guess it could go, like, here somewhere or in here. It kind of, kind of makes sense putting it in here. In fact, we can pick it up. We can place it wherever we want, and then we can pick it up. Okay. So I'm going to place it. We don't want it sticking through the box, through the wall or anything like that. Um, that's going to take too much room. We could go here. It's kind of like tucked out of the way then. But I don't know. Does it need to be somewhere a little bit more shown? Like some, like here somewhere? Or that's really the only place it can go. Like in the middle of the room is another option. But I don't really like that. Let's try out a spot here. All right. How's that? I, I, I don't like that at all. 
It's right. Oh, it's sort of up against the stone wall. It just looks silly there. It just doesn't make any sense having it there. I just don't know where else we can do with it. Where else can we put it? I mean, we can throw it like over here somewhere. We can put it in this back corner over here even. Or just, you know, up against the back wall. I don't know. What do we do with it? It's just such a big piece of machinery. It's gonna, it's gonna look good wherever we put it. I should put it in that corner. That would be cool, but there's just like the fridges and stuff kind of ruin that. Wait, hey, hold on a second. All that lights just turned on because it's nighttime. Awesome. Maybe that's what we can do today. Maybe we can go for a bit of a fly around because at nighttime, all the big Engram things come out to play. It's awesome. It's awesome. All right, let's throw it down. I reckon we're just going to leave it here. Will that do? It looks goofy. I know it looks goofy. But maybe if we go and move these fridges, which we're going to do eventually anyway, maybe it'll all work out. The question is, is this thing powered by electricity or not? Switch to electricity. It is. And we can just turn it on as we please. I mean, we can have this running all the time if we really want it. That's cool. I like that. All right. Well, maybe this doesn't have to be on. Because that lets off so much light. Nah, that looks goofy. That looks goofy as. Let's turn that off. All right, sweet. Anyways, the base is all set. It's all lit up. It's really... Ah, the, the lighting in this game is so uneven. It's, it's always so hit and miss. Let's go for a bit of a fly around. Let's see if we can find some cool supply drops or stuff like that today. In fact... One last thing we do need to do is replace these mortar and pestles. So let's go and do that. That's the last step of the puzzle. We've got to get it done. We'll go and demolish these. We're going to have to craft another three extra ones. But there's plenty of ingredients in them. And hopefully uh, hopefully it's enough to get three new ones going. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to demolish it. I don't think there's anything in this one. There isn't. We'll demolish the wooden table as well. And now it's, it's just Lachlan's beer barrel, which actually has five things of beer in it. That's right, I put thatch in there. And there were so many comments on my video like, put thatch in there, you need thatch for beer. And I was like, I know, I've already put it in there. I did it off camera though. But uh, we got there eventually. We did it. Let's get ourselves mortar and pestle. How many can we get? Just one. I need stone and I need hide. More stone than hide though. All right, what well, we got? We got a lot of both of them. So stone and hide. We should be able to get two extra of these now. There we go. There we go. Three mortar and pestles on the way. That's what I'm talking about. And uh, we're going to throw this down there. All right. So, so let's go drop these suckers down. We're going to go and start with the center one. Right. There-ish. We're going to go place one on the left. Like there-ish. And then one on the right. Like there-ish. And then we... What? Is that nighttime over already? I was gonna go look for supply drops though. You can't be serious. This is the problem. I gotta fix this thing with the server. Nighttime goes way too fast. Way too fast. All right, we got we got all these like stuff now that we don't need and stuff. Let's get rid of most of it. There we go. All right, so we're good. Let's get a little bit of food and we're going on an adventure, Bob. We're going on an adventure. Don't know why you're called Bob now. Where's all our food though? I don't want to eat fish meat. Where's all the foods at? What? All right, we're cooking up. We're cooking up some raw meat, apparently. I don't know what I did with the food. Um, I also need to come over here and grab something. We've got like, we've got like beer steins somewhere. Where, where, where are the bottles at? There's jugs somewhere. I dumped a whole bunch of the suckers down. Where are they at? I threw, I threw them down somewhere. In here. Where's the glass? There's like glass bottles somewhere. I swear I put them, I put them somewhere. I have no idea what I do with them, but I dropped them somewhere. Anyways, whatever. We'll take our meat, we'll turn you off. Let's go get ourselves our guardian angel. Where you at, bro? Where is my guardian angel? There you are, there you are. Why are you in the, in the middle of all these other dinosaurs? Now let's go for a bit of a fly around. Let's see if any, 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 uh, anything spawns. Do we have anything around apart from a little greenie to my right? There's two little greenies to the right. Anything better than that? Like a gold or a red or something like that? Maybe we're going to go... Oh, there's a gold. I see a gold in the distance. Or maybe it's still nighttime. But all my lights turned off. I don't understand why that happened. Ho, ho, ho. It's so foggy. Why has it got a storm every single day? Oh, and that's the other thing. That's the other thing. We, we came across this. Um, survivor profile. 
So there's a new survivor profile in the game. Apparently, you got to find survivor notes around the world. But apparently, none of them are on the center. They're all on Scorched Earth or the, uh, the islands. So, unfortunately, we can't find any of the notes this season, which kind of sucks. But if we do another season, I guess we'll, we'll be able to find the survivor notes then. Anyways, there's a gold beacon in the distance over there. I'm thinking we go check that out. And then I think we come back and we get the one that's closer to us. It's weird. I have barely checked out this island over here. This is the, the, the death island or a devil island. Not devil island, like volcanic island. We haven't been here twice. We've been here once. We haven't really returned ever. We kind of flew past it like when we first started the series with Lachlan. But that was it. It's kind of like an unexplored territory to me. I don't know why we've never been here. We just, we just never have... But let's go get this gold beacon and hopefully we can find something good inside of it. Don't disappoint me, gold beacon. Give me some flak armor or something cool like that. All right, here we go. Here we go. Drop me down. Drop me down. Give me the goods, baby. Give me the goods. That's not the goods. That's not the goods I was looking for, unfortunately. But uh, you tried. And thank you very much for that. Do we have anything else good around or what? We got blue over here. I want a red. Oh, there's another gold over there, actually. There's a purple in the water down there. We're not going to go and get that. But there's a little goldie up there on the uh, the snow mountain. I mean, why not, right? Why not? Oh, it's not gold. I think it's just a white one. I think I think that's just a whitey. It's just a whitey. Wow, you little deceiving piece of trash. <gasps> that gold one over there is in the water. We probably shouldn't go for that then. Every time we've gone in the water, we seem to die. Don't, I don't feel good about going in the water again, to be honest. Look at the little T-Rexes up here. There's Argies and T-Rexes, and this is where we found our Giga as well. I don't really feel like finding a Giga today, to be honest. But there's no red beacons around. Let's find out how deep this thing is. How deep, what are we working with here? How deep are we talking? I think it's pretty shallow. This one here might not actually be that bad. Let's have a little peek. We just go for it. Let me get some stamina, all right? We'll get this little blue one. We'll see what's inside of the blue one. I'm predicting a crop plot. It's an apprentice itchy saddle. That's not too bad, actually. That's kind of cool. That's really good, actually. Let's get this little goldie now. I just got to fly as low to the water as I can without hitting the water. And let's go. All right. Well, up. Oh. All right, hopefully there's no sharks or anything nearby. It looks pretty good. The coast is clear. Let's go and get this thing. What are we going to get inside? Give me the goods. Come on. Whoa, a Megalodon saddle and a, another Apprentice Itchy saddle. Out of two. Oh, what are you doing all the way up there, mate? I can't reach you up there. Oh, no, we can. Oh, no, we can't. No, we can't. You're too high up, bro. You piece of trash. You're supposed to stay down here with me so I can get a quick way out. We got ourselves two Apprentice Itchy saddles. And come over here, mate. And a Megalodon saddle. Come over. All right. So maybe we should go tame ourselves some itchies. I just, I just, we just haven't had a whole lot of luck with, with dinosaurs. With, with water dinosaurs in particular. No luck at all, in fact. Come over here, mate. Let's go. All right. Let's see if we can find some itchies close to land. We got two awesome saddles that are going to give him like, they're going to make him a lot stronger than their standard selves. But you know what we're going to do? We've got, we got to go closer to our base. Because last time we tamed anything around here, we got messed up instantly. Like, really badly. And we don't want to go through that again. No way. So I'm going to fly to, like, the start of our little offshoot there. And then we'll try and find some dolphins nearby. Okay, so this is where our river sort of begins. There's a lot of pteranodons around here. I wouldn't mind getting some more of them. Um, unless I've... Have I... No, 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 our river's up here. I was like, have I passed it? But we, but, but we haven't. I just I just underestimated how big this area is. We're also running a little bit slow because we've got all these saddles on us, and saddles weigh like 20 kilos a piece, and my pteranodon ain't too good at carrying weight, apparently. So that's a bit on the downside, but oh, good. We also got to find something to give us some prime meat, preferably. We got to get some prime meat to tame these dolphins. And there is a Kano here and a Raptor. The Raptor's not so good. The Kano, on the other hand, I could do with. Wait, we run out of stamina right now? This is not the time. It's not the time to... Oh, come on. Come on. Not the time. Not the time. Can I get up here, please? Please, please, please? 
just land. Don't, don't fly down. I need you to land. I need you to land right here. Okay, good man. Good man. We gotta find some stegos. I don't, I don't feel up to, to fighting a, uh, one of them. One of them. I don't feel up to a Kano. Although, there are some turtles fighting them. Maybe weakening them a little bit. Tiny little bits. We might have a little bit of luck. We got our stamina. Let's find out. Are you guys weakening, weakening the sucker or what? Just at least kill the raptor. You know what? I'll help you guys out. Give you guys a hand, okay? We got 70 meat just then. That's good. Come on. We're just going to take out the Kano now. <laughs> take out the Kano. All right. Nope. Not, ha not happening. Not. Nope. Nope. Yep. Yeah, maybe. Nope. Spin it. Spin it. Spin it. Damn it. Spin it. Okay. It's not happening. <laughs> it's not happening. Let's try again. There we go. There we go. We're just trying to help the turtle. I think we're actually killing the turtle instead, though. On the downside, all that just happened was he ate the meat from the turtle, healed himself up, and now we got no chance. Anyways, we'll leave the guy out. We'll find some stagos or something instead. And unfortunately, there ain't a whole lot of stegos around. What do we got here? It's only a level 28 Tyranodon. I want a high level. Yeah, you sit down, bro. Sit down. We got any dolphins nearby, though? I can see sharks, stingrays. I freaking hate stingrays. More sharks over there. Hey, 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 hey. No, 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 no. Not today, mate. Not today. I ain't dying to another stingray. Hell no. You stay away, mate. You stay well away. All right. This is a bad spot. We got, we got to find a better, we got to find a better location. Let's see if over here, just a tiny little bit over here is, is any, any better. Any more fortuitous. All right. What are we dealing with over here, eh? Oh, come on. Just give me one little dolphin. That's all I ask for. Well... There doesn't seem to be any dolphins around. <laughs> How are there no dolphins around? They're like... Yesterday we got swarmed by like 10 of them. Today, there's nothing. Nothing at all. What even? Oh, no. That's, that's, that's a freaking very large... Not what I'm looking for. That's what that is. Very large, not what I'm looking for. All right. Whoa. It looks like this is shark territory. No dolphins. Seriously, mate. Stay away. Stay away from me. I will destroy you. Oh, piranhas. What are piranhas doing out here in the ocean? All I want is a dolphin. Everything but dolphins. Why is there everything but dolphins out here? Yeah, that's right. What you get? What you get, little manta? Manta! What you get? Look at all the meat this guy's giving me. Apparently, if you kill stuff with sickles, sometimes you get different stuff. Nah, just meat. There's a dolphin. I can see. There's... Okay. Hey, 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 whoa. Oh, whoa! What the hell? He just destroyed my armor with a hit! Alright, well, we've made it back home. I'm here for one thing and one thing only. To drop off these saddles. Then we can at least fly properly again. In, in fact, I might actually be here for two things. I, I should probably... This thing's cool. Let's put it in this one here. I should probably go and repair all of my armor just in case we come across some mantas again and they decide to give me a hard time again, which they will, which they will. They always do. They never fail. They never fail not to. And I forgot that down the other end of the river, all we find is swamp and more little like river things. There's no itchies down here is what I'm saying. So here's what I'm thinking we got to do. One on my agenda, maybe not number one first thing we're going to do is I need to find myself a, a level 100 plus Pteranodon, like a level 150 Pteranodon. Something that has weight, that has speed, that has stamina, that has the whole nine yards. I need everything. Ooh, 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 ooh. There's a wild Kano right outside of our base. Right outside of our base. This means it probably killed one of our dinosaurs, didn't it? Didn't it? No, it didn't. It hasn't. That's good. That's good. I thought we had like a T-Rex or something down here a little while ago. I thought maybe it killed it. It didn't. Thankfully. Oh, no. Now everything's back up here. Lucky Lachlan brought it all back up. But um, yeah, we got to find that. Then I want to find an Ichi. Then I want to maybe possibly start going deep sea loot crate diving again. Like last season, we did a lot of that, especially in streams and stuff like that, which will be returning next year. I'm going to be streaming more next year. I'm going to get a schedule down pat. We're going to be sticking to that. But for today, we're wrapping this video up. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Ark Survival Evolved. If you enjoyed it, please go ahead, punch the thumbs up, make it rain those thumbs ups. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye for now. Just want to move a few out on the floor.
Yeah.